Let's uh, see your licenses and parts, please. Okay. okay. Well, we're going to check these out. That you guys got for geese here. Why do we have to check these birds in like this? Well, the biggest reason is because with these tightly regulated goose seasons that we're experiencing nowadays, you know, we just need to keep a real close watch on how many of the different subspecies are being harvested, and in particular those duskies, you know, because everything is generated by these dusky quotas. And uh, and once we reach those quotas, of course, the, the goose season is closed, but uh, uh, we just really need to keep a close handle on that so we know what the makeup of the harvest is and what's going on out there in the field. Okay. And this one is an adult male. We'll then measure the total length of the bill. Now, why on earth do you measure the bill? I mean, that's something that's impossible to do out in the field. And the biggest thing for us as it comes in here is it's just a, a, a real good way for us to break it out to the subspecies. Um, it's it's yeah, a legal it, definition. Yeah, it's part of the legal definition that's adopted by the states to, uh, to classify birds to a dusky mm -hmm. subspecies. And also scientifically, the Coleman is the best criteria to use. Okay. There is a little bit of overlap on the bill measurement between other subspecies, and that's why we don't just rely upon that. We mm -hmm. look at the color, we look at the length of the leg bone. And this one is 29.9. So by virtue of the fact that this beak is 32 millimeters or less, it's a cackling Canada goose. So, and we'll do the breast color. It looks to me like this is going to shake out about a six. Hunters who mistakenly or intentionally take a dusky have met the season quota and are not allowed to hunt in the area for the remainder of the season. The same is true for hunters who fail to check geese at check stations. Well, we do take these regulations seriously enough that in most cases a citation would be issued. It is a criminal citation which can involve jail sentences. That's, of course, very rare, uh, but of course fines are imposed. And in most cases, when we do detect a violation or encounter a violation, a citation is issued. 